guys welcome back to my channel so today I figured I would go ahead and switch it up a bit so instead of a vlog I wanted to do more of a sit down video with like my fall favorites slash things that I'm using right now in this season and pretty much for every other season for every season as well so um also thank you guys so much y'all I made it to 10k Oh my god, I'm so happy. So last night I went to sleep, I was at 9,999 and it took forever. So I'm like, you know what, forget this, I'm going to sleep. I woke up and I was at 10,001 or two, no, 10,002 subscribers. So thank you guys so much. Thank you for clicking on this video and every video. If you've been here for a while as well, thank you for clicking on all of my videos, leaving me comments, giving me a thumbs up because that truly matters and helps me out so much especially when you subscribe because it helps my channel out a ton so thank y'all so much ah oh, thank you guys so that's a huge goal of mine that i wanted to finish by the end of september and by the time you guys watch this video it'll be october so um i think the second or the third of october I don't know but this is the last week and I'm so happy so I made it right on time with that goal so thank you guys again so I went to switch things up but first y'all already know when I start a video I will start it off with a prayer first so today's prayer is dear God thank you for waking me up Lord today I pray that you will remove our fears and anxieties help us trust in your plan and your guidance inspire us with your love and compassion so that our souls can always be satisfied in you help us to reflect your character in our life thank you for hearing our prayer in jesus name amen so i hope that prayer blesses you today so let's get started with this vlog I wanted to start off with fall scents or scents that I'm enjoying right now. So I love using wax melts, essential oils, and candles. I don't use them all. all I, I don't use them all at the same time. But I wanted to start off with my absolute favorite candle, which is the Lee's candle from Bath and Body Works. You guys, I love this candle, and I make sure to stock up so that like that I can use it all year round. I don't go through them as much. I just mainly burn them downstairs. I don't burn candles upstairs. But, oh my God. This candle smells so good. It smells like um, like a cinnamon steak slash some other stuff. I don't know how to explain it. I'm not very good with explaining scents. Okay, so this one, it has, it's, it has um, crisp red apple, golden nectar, warm clove spice with natural essential oils so they have like three no this lady told me they had like five different packagings i like this one because it's brown and, and it goes more with my fall decor because the packaging does matter <laughs> to me anyway the way it looks sometimes if it looks too cartoony i really don't like those but oh my god this candle smells so good so i'm good it lasts me a long time because i don't use just candles i also use wax warm uh wax melts and essential oils as well as well now this candle is my second favorite which is sweater weather and this is john's favorite scent like he loves everything sweater weather i get him the um antibacterial spray the little antibacterial gel um he likes the hand soap so we literally stock up with the sweater weather hand soap as well and this just smells just good it smells so good and i can use this all year round but, but the thing is the good thing is that with leaves and sweater weather and stuff like that they do sell those at Christmas as well, just with different packaging. Like this one, what does it say? Fresh sage, juniper berries, arom aromatic eucalyptus, fresh woods with natural essential oils. So it just smells really, really good. So I just got myself one of these. I really don't go through candles very fast because I do like using other stuff, but um, those are my two favorite scents right now for fall for from bath and body works and then i like using a lot of wax warmers in my house mainly of course downstairs because the kids bedrooms are upstairs so everything like stuff like this i just keep it downstairs so for fall these wax warmers you can wax melts you can find them from at walmart this one is the autumn air and it smells so good this one is the big one by the sensational brand 
it just smells amazing and when it's it's it says autumn air it's sweater weather and it smells really good you can find this at walmart and then the sensationals as well for no place like home this one is sweet cinnamon and clove and this one's the one that i'm um warming up right now in my wax warmer in the kitchen it's like this you know burgundy color Oh, this one smells kind of close. I would have to say this smells pretty close to the leaves candle. The one called No Place Like Home. Because it has a lot of the same stuff with the cinnamon and the clove in it. So it smells really good. But this wax melt is my absolute favorite for the entire year. It don't matter if it's Christmas, fall, summer. I love it so much, which is the Better Homes and Garden Lime Dried Linen. Y'all, that smells so so very good it smells clean it just oh my god that smells so good it smells like laundry soap and just clean I, I don't know how to explain it It just smells think of clean cotton plus like laundry soap or something like that like if you're doing laundry it's just I don't know and I also warm this up in my office oh, and y'all these are hard to find sometimes they sell out really fast I check on the website they be sold out so I check all the time and then when they are in stock I stock stock up on these a lot of times they're sold out at the store and you have to always check so check online and also check um, in store as well I do love having my house smelling good like when you first come in that's like literally the first thing it don't mean it, it doesn't matter if you get someone's getting ready to work in my house or something um, like fix something the first thing they're coming on is the fact that it smells really good here okay so this this is an essential oil you could get this from amazon and this is where i order it from y'all they have the fall spice um essential oil oh my god i love this so much when you walk in just think of like um a simmering pot like some like you know how you add cinnamon sticks and um orange slices of oranges and stuff like that into the simmering pot oh my god this is what this smells like and you could get this on amazon and they have a wide variety the same brand has a wide variety of smells as well so they have apple cider they have autumn wreath now i just finished the autumn wreath it completely is out y'all i need to order another one it smells so good and then they have the apple cider this one smells like the apple um mrs myers apple cider um cleaner pretty close to it but just a little bit different but it smells so good when you smell this you just smell fall so i i just love stuff like this i love um seasonal smells and all that good stuff because you know how when you look back to your childhood memories and stuff and certain smells bring back those certain memories that's kind of what it is for me when i use seasonal scents like that that smells like fall <laughs> that smells like christmas like a christmas tree you get what i'm saying so you can get these on Amazon I'll make sure to the, the stuff that I can link I will leave the links down in my description box you guys always ask me what I use in the house so I, I figured I'd go ahead and share it which I do share it in most of my videos anyway so um, I hope that helps <laughs> know that I absolutely love to clean I'm one of those weird ones that actually enjoy cleaning so basically I like but to make it more fun I had to change my mindset and my mindset as something that was mundane and boring and had to, just had to get done so I switched things around like for example I use fun cleaners that smell really nice like one of my favorites for fall is the Mrs. Meyer apple cider cleaner um, I don't like all of the fall scents like I don't like the mum smell that's just not that one I really don't like I don't think it stinks it's just not my favorite but I do like the apple cider um sand for Mrs. Myers and I like to clean with that and then the good thing about the cleaners is that even like you'll walk out and go back in your kitchen let's say two hours later and it's still you can still smell the cleaner which I absolutely love but then they came out with with the Mrs. Myers clean day no not mrs Myers clean day the mrs Myers fall leaves this is new because i didn't even know about this till my friend tiff um she was the one who told me about it well showed you guys and that's how i saw it and even when i went to the store i didn't see it on the shelves i had to order it and that's how i was able to find it so this one smells really good this one has like um i don't know how to explain it let me see let me smell it so i can this one I feel like it has 
I want to say it smells like a leaves. It's probably just the name. But this one, is, I'm not passing, guys. It's just this. Um, I feel like it has more of a male smell. I don't know how it's, it smells like a man, but it smells good. It smells spicy. That's all I can say. I can explain. I, you have to smell it for yourself to know, but I really love these two cleaners for the fall. I just bust them out. And when I buy something, I'll buy more than one. That's just me. I'll just buy more than one because I like to use it during the duration of that time. And I go through cleaners very fast. Now, if you've been watching my channel for a while, then you know what I love to do. One of my hobbies is to bake. I absolutely love baking. I have been enjoying this cookbook, this baking book. I love cookbooks in general, but I really love this one. I recently tried this recipe. This one came out really good. The kids asked me, can I make it again? And I probably uh, bring the same recipe to one of our small groups. But it says, as the season's first crisp air arrives and the leaves dance with color, bake your way through fall with this collection of heirloom southern recipes and they are so good and you know what's crazy some of the recipes look a little bit intimidating because i've never done them before but i personally like to challenge myself and when you do it if you follow the recipes like it's supposed to it will come out the way it's supposed to so um so i definitely recommend this cookbook i like cookbooks that has pictures i don't i need to see the visual of what it's supposed to look like um or even makes me want to eat it or make it in the first place so i like that each recipe has um pictures in it it's just so pretty and i would buy this i would give this as a gift to someone else it's just so many ideas here and the fact that not all the recipes are pumpkin recipes because honestly you guys i'm not really a big pumpkin fa fan i've never tried pumpkin spice before or anything like pumpkin flavor i have tried pumpkin pie and that's a no for me um but i'll do sweet potato so like they have the upside down sweet potato cake just like pineapple upside down cake they have the upside down sweet potato cake this one looks so good and i think that this one actually might be the next one that i try so let me know if you guys would like to see that y'all know i love sharing my the bait the baking with you all but i would not mind trying this you know what let me bookmark it real quick while i'm talking to you guys about it but definitely recommend this cookbook i will leave the link down in my description box for that as well i think you guys have a lot of you have um bought this cookbook i definitely recommend it and you can also use it as decor because i put mine on the kitchen counter <music> recently I just discovered the Mayel twisting souffle I have been enjoying using this in my hair right now I'm like on day five of my twist out um, so far so good and I really like how much definition it gives it without making my hair super hard or dry so I've been trying this one because the one that I was using previously which is the afro love it works amazing but the price on that has gone up because it's not made here it's imported from the Medicare Republic so um, I think it went up to $17 and the way my hair sucks up products and I am very proud of heavy I go through products pretty quickly so I just went ahead and see if I could try something new and this one so far so good so I recommend this I also use their um, mousse I really enjoy using their mousse I use the mousse on Destiny's hair as well but once her afro love um, cream finishes up I'm gonna start using this on hers so I'm just gonna get another one because um Destiny has her stuff and I have my stuff. We kind of don't share the same stuff because I'm not going to go back under the sink, look for my hair products to use on her hair or go to her caddy and find, you get what I'm saying? I, I buy two of everything when it comes to our stuff. But a lot of the stuff for her hair doesn't work on mine because she has a looser curl pattern versus mine. So this one I definitely recommend. Um, if you have hair texture like mine or a little looser, um, I really like this. <music> So I also wanted to share with you guys my face products that I use. I've been using this for a few months now. I think I started using them around February. I think so. But I love using Avena products. I've shared with this with you guys before. Um, right now I'm using Positively Ready Skin Brightening Daily Scrub. Now I love using this daily scrub. Now I don't personally use it every single day, but 
I actually um, have noticed a huge difference. I do have pretty clear skin now. I don't hardly suffer from breakouts or anything and it's pretty like just nice and clear. So I really like using this. It says gently removes impurities for softer, brighter, more even toned skin. And I could definitely see that with my face because I was having an issue where literally I was having breakouts all right here through my like my jawline and even on my neck. And now when I do the face scrub, I do it on my face, but also I've always done it on my neck and I've definitely noticed a difference with that. And then I also use, especially if I'm gonna go outside, I like to use their moisturizers. And then this one, the Positively Radiant Daily Moisturizer Sunscreen has broad spectrum of SPF 15. And if I'm gonna go out, I definitely use that one first. And, Cause most of the time I am home. So this is not the main one that I use. The main one that I use is the Aveeno Clear Complexion Daily Moisturizer moisturizer it has a acne treatment in here plus tone correcting now this one is the one that i mainly use every single day but right now on my face i have the positively radiant um, because it has sunscreen and i gotta go out but the everyday one that i use is a clear complexion and i use that morning and night times the same moisturizer that i use and i have noticed a huge difference no breakouts on my face i was going through a a period of time where no matter what I was using my face was breaking out but I haven't had breakouts in a very long time so I definitely recommend these facial products I get them all from Amazon and I think Walmart sells them as well so right now I want to share with you guys my favorite shows so I actually watch more TV in the fall time slash winter more than I do in the summertime because a lot of shows come back from hiatus and stuff like that and I'm just getting into it's just something about when it's dark and just getting cozy up to watch TV so some of the shows that I'm watching right now they have been out for years it's been off the air for years you guys also watch these shows like the first one I want to share with you is Sons of Anarchy I am loving this show. I am very slow with the episodes because I probably could have been binge watched it and already finished. But since, you know, I work, this is my job. I have kids, I have a husband. Um, and I pretty much watch like an episode, maybe two at night um, before going to sleep. So I'm still on episode, I mean, season three. But you, many of you have watched this show because I've asked you. And y'all keep telling me, just wait and see, just wait and see what's gonna happen. One of you even said that you can't wait to see, for me to see the finale. So I'm like, ooh, girl, what's gonna happen? So I wanna get through it, but it is so, so good. Um, you definitely um, start forming like your favorite characters in the show and you get angry and stuff like that. Um, but I am really loving that show right now. Also, something that I'm watching with my husband is House of the Dragon on HBO Max. John and I were literally obsessed with Game of Thrones once that went off, which by the way, season 8, I'm still mad about season 8. But now they came out with House of the Dragon and I am loving that show as well right now. It's on HBO Max. I recommend if you like shows like that. It's very gory. This is not something you would want to watch uh, with kids. Actually, a lot of the shows I watch is not for kids. <laughs> But this is a show that I watch with my husband. Even though it comes every Sunday night, John and I normally watch it on a Monday night because Sunday nights we're busy. We go to small groups and stuff, and by the time we come home, we shower and go to sleep. So we watch normally on Monday nights. So I definitely recommend that show, especially if you are a Game of Thrones fan. Now, I absolutely love time period shows from back in the day. And I mean back, back in the day. Um, right now, I am enjoying Outlander. I've read all of the books. I mean, I was pregnant with David when I discovered the books and throughout my whole pregnancy, I read the books. The books are this thick and it's like a bunch of them. So um, right now they have the show is on stars. I recommend it. it. Also the shows, I think season one through five is on Netflix. So if you guys want to go ahead and check it out, it's about um, a, a nurse. She was, was she a British nurse? I don't know child. Um, basically she went she was on a honeymoon with her husband in Scotland not to give it away um, and then she went 
to the stones in Scotland and she went it took her back in time to 1700s so it's really good um I love that show I recommend that show of course you guys know I love the Tudors um Becoming Elizabeth a lot of those shows I've watched um the Great on Hulu is very good as well. Right now, they just came out with The Serpent Queen on Stars. I can't wait to start that. I'm going to start that with Shanti. We were supposed to start it together. So I wonder if she started without me. But anyways, I got to get that started. I think I might start on that tonight. I love shows like that, y'all. Like The White Queen, The Princess Whatever, The Spanish Queen. I love stuff like that. So I like watching stuff. Um, those type of shows and then for fall something a show that I just got into a few years ago and I watched all the season but I think of fall when I um I watched this show which is the Gilmore Girls it's very good they have it on Netflix I think and then they came out with another season a few years ago that was more updated so I really um enjoy that show I usually watch it during the fall time or sometimes you you can catch it on cable TV or local channels they'll do like a marathon so I really like that as well so if you have any shows for me that you would like for me to check out or watch I'll let you guys know down in the comments if I watched it before um, I, I do like watching good good TV um, <laughs> it's just a thing it's a it's the way i relax at night just i just can't binge watch like i used to um but i hope you all enjoyed this video i just wanted to switch it up if you have any ideas maybe i could do this type of video again maybe for christmas time or you would like to meet for me to show different products i use somewhere else in the house just let me know down in the comments so i hope you all enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already and keep a lookout for my next videos, you guys. Bye.